right arm. You put your right arm in, you put your right arm out, you put your right arm in, and then you shake it all about. My name's Mitch. I've been training in Krav Maga for about seven, a little over seven years, and I've been teaching for just about three years. I'm a police officer. Uh, my first name is uh, Rick, and my last name is Ortiz. Uh, I am a fifth grade teacher, and I mainly teach kids who are uh, between the ages of 10 and 11, and I teach all subjects. Uh, I do think that Krav Maga is a good system for any citizen. Even if you are a, a law-abiding citizen who has a, a pistol permit and carry a, a, a firearm for protection, um, a lot of times uh, if you are, end up in a situation where someone's pointing a gun in your face, you're not going to have time to, to go for your weapon that you're carrying. Uh, you have to address that threat right away. I feel more confident uh, in safety as far as uh, going out with friends. Uh, I don't feel as um, up on guard while I'm out. I feel a little bit more aware of my surroundings. Uh, I feel that if something were to happen, I'd be uh, more prepared to handle myself in situations uh, that came up where I had to defend myself. Uh, Krav Maga has definitely uh, helped with that in that area as far as confidence goes. Hi, my name is Sam Bodie, and I have pre-reg Tassia, and this is my good friend John. Hi, I'm John Ratzenberger, and I'm a good friend of Sam's. How's that so far? Pretty good. Very good. Now what? Now the lines. Oh, okay. Friedrich's ataxia is a progressive neuromuscular disease that robs a person of their ability to walk, talk, and write. It can cause cardiac disease, scoliosis, and diabetes. Well, what Friedrich's ataxia has to rub me up is by sense of humor as everyone can tell from this video and thank <laughs> you John. It also ha didn't stop me from graduating from college and it hasn't stopped me from pursuing my dream career. She directed this. Which is filming, not acting or directing. To us well she's going to edit this. There we go. Night's gonna be